All right, welcome back to another episode of Spider-Man Remastered. I really hope you guys are having a great day today, staying safe out there and all that good stuff. But all right, let's get right into it. So if you guys missed last episode, we went up against Electro and Vulture in this pretty cool boss fight. But uh, it seems we're going to be going after Scorpion this time around. So uh, that should be pretty interesting. All right, let's get right into it. Now, if I was a mercenary dressed like a scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! Ah! Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you, which I respect. Damn it! What did he inject me with? Whoa! What the? Is that a sea of poison? Can't be. This can't be real. Must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. Gotta get to higher ground and analyze whatever he injected me with. You know something? This mission always reminded me of the mission in Arkham Asylum, where uh, Batman gets also uh, stung or pierced by uh, Scarecrow's uh, poison. This is essentially the same premises if you really think about it. Should be safe for a minute. I need to analyze the neurotoxin so I can create an antidote. Scorpions made some upgrades. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create nightmares that my body thinks are real. I have to create the antidote fast. First, I need a natural steroid. Extract from an Eclipta Alba plant should do the trick. ESU's greenhouse is nearby. Hope it's in season. All right, I'm going to try to do this uh, a perfect run because for some reason, from all the times I've played this game, I always hit the water. So this time around, my uh, personal goal is going to be... Oh, that was really close. Is not hitting the uh, poisoned water. It's going to be a big no-no. Oh, wait, I think I took the wrong turn. Clipped Alba should be inside the greenhouse. There it is. It can be both. Doc? It's just the hallucinations. You can get through this. Doc, you sound... Like I did before the neural interface affected my mind. My obsessions were always there, but the interface allowed me to fully embrace them. I have to fix this. Fix you! Somehow! Ah, uh, Peter. Always trying to shoulder the responsibility. Even when there's no hope. I can't tell you how many times your unfettered optimism has kept me going when things look bleak. I miss being with you. I really miss you. I'm sorry, Doc. I'm so sorry. Yeah. There's the Eclipse doll. Yeah, this is pretty dark, man. Oh my god, dude, I almost fell. Gotta get there fast. Two deadly scorpion tanks. Lovely. Thanks, brain. You're all panic crawling up just fine. Scorpion? How'd you get this number? Always asking the least interesting questions. It's not how am I calling you? It's am I calling you? Maybe I'm just a fever screen. Dying brain. Real or no? When I cure this poison, I'm coming for you, Mac. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god, you guys have no idea how hard I'm clenching my toes. Jesus, dude, those freaking scorpion tails really caught me off guard right there. me? No, I would let my genius shine on its own. I saw you, Peter, taking notes, stealing ideas, a rat in my own lab. To think I called you a friend. That's a really nice shot. For the record, uh, I recently found out that you can I actually do this. Friend, Otto. Please. Like, just hang there. I always supported you. I always will. Supported me by selling my ideas to Norman by Sterilis. The Atropine. Got the Atropine. Now I just need to mix up the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. Kill with me. And here the jerk. Sorry to bust up your plans. Oh, man, don't worry. There are plenty of surprises left for you. We'll be seeing each other again. Count on it. And scorpion tails, man. You know, oh, God, that's a lot. <laughs> they're they're exaggerating now. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll elaborate more at the end of the video on why I like this mission so much. There we go. Made it. Somehow. But I'm running out of time. I need to mix the antidote. Finally, the real lab. No more hallucination. I think not. You're in my domain now. You're just like us, boy. Trying to steal my genius. Everything that happens now is your fault! I knew you were laughing at me! All of you! I thought I forgot about you! Scorpion! Are you exactly me an opening? Another hallucination. At least he had an imaginary glass jaw. We got six scorpions. Sure it is. Now I know you're the poison trying to distract me. Bring it on. I'm just trying to hit Ooh. it. Working. Okay. One down. You're a loser. All you'll ever be is a loser. You get to me. Wait, I wonder if this is gonna work. Hold on. There we go. Focus on the job. 
Wait, I saw that you were gonna be able to do a finisher on them. So I'm gonna, I wanna see that. Hold on, there we go. That's pretty cool. It's like fighting internet trolls. Knock one down and I'm pop up. decontamination a little too far I better put some clothes on much better let's just go ahead and forget that ever happened so at least we do get to see the uh, spidey underwear suit at least once throughout the story that's pretty cool because I think uh, in order to get that suit you uh, have to 100% the entire game still foggy need to work the last of this poison out of my system before I tackle the other villains good time to go on patrol yeah I would explore the city if there was anything else to explore I essentially did everything in my previous episodes <laughs> uh, the only thing I could really do now is just wait but uh, before I end the video I just want to talk a little bit about this mission and that is that I really like it for the fact that we get to really see inside the psyche of uh, Peter and Spider-Man. Uh, well they're essentially the same person. Uh, not essentially they are the same person right but um, um, we get to see the doubt that Peter has and uh, the blame that he carries you know hey, that he feels for uh, Octavius in a sense a turning. Question at you. When is it okay to give up on a friend? Oh wow Pete. Thinking of Otto? That obvious, huh? Yeah, understandable though. Man, the high-minded, generous part of me wants to say never. Being a true friend means being there, even when people lose their way. But with what Otto's done, I just don't know, Pete. I guess you have to decide if the Otto Octavius you knew was still in there or not. Maybe if he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process some stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you. Yeah, that's pretty interesting. Yeah, because uh, throughout that mission, we did hear Peter almost in the verge of tears, you know? I definitely feel like Otto was more to Peter than just a friend, you know? Almost like a father figure, really, you know, after Uncle Ben died and all that stuff. And, I mean, we can't really say that Iron Man is here for uh, this Spider-Man, right? So he had it really rough, and uh, Otto was really the only person there. So it definitely, uh, it's definitely understandable why it hurts Peter this much. But uh, another thing before I end the video is that I really like this mission for another reason. It's because it really feels Scorpion appropriate, you know? Last episode, I mentioned that I just wish that every Sinister Six villain had its own mini boss fight or something like that. And uh, this is kind of an example of that, you know, it's uh, scorpion driven, scorpion focused, and uh, it's pretty cool, you know, I just wished uh, that was the case with Rhino, um, you know, Electro and Vulture, and, you know, that they had their own uh, unique little boss fights. But uh, anyways, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode, and uh, I guess I'll see you guys next time. Peace.